Hello, filmmaking friends, fanatics, and otherwise folks. Let's talk about this exciting, crazy, biggest bag ever created that I got online to keep my light stuff in. This bag is serious business. Um, it looks to be about 39, 40 inches long. I know I measured it because I wanted to make sure it would hold all my gear. Um, it's incredibly heavy. In fact, I think, oh, yeah, I'll be calling my chiropractor after this video shoot. Let's take a look inside. It has these great straps that can hold things on top or just tighten it up if you have a lot of gear that you want to keep it snug. Inside, it's got this great cavern. Perfect for dead bodies. I mean, um, perfect for like light gear. Um, here's the stuff I have in it. I've got two of these quad rollout power extension things. They're best thing I ever bought. Uh, I have this little bag with um, some additional little lights, cables, and things like that in here. Uh, I've got my SWAT team like photo vest thing I keep in here. It just looks cool when I wear it. Makes me feel like some kind of special agent. Uh, I've got this very expensive piece of foam that I got at the fabric store to wrap my lights. Uh, these thousand watt halogens. The other one's not in here because it's on right now. So I've got this in there wrapped up. There's probably a safer way, but anyway, it all fits. I've got a little makeup kit to help my film stars and actors look beautiful. Or at least not sweaty. Uh, I've got one of those fold out. Check this out. This is great. Whoa. Oh, one of these reflector things. These are fantastic. It looks like you're launching the uh, Apollo moon mission. Um, I have another tripod. I just cannibalized the uh, head. I used the head for this on my glider and on my rig, but um, it never really hurts to have an extra backup tripod. Got this at Best Buy. I've got a couple umbrellas. The other one's in use right now, but these are the uh, reflective umbrellas for either singing, performing musicals, walking in the rain with small children, or reflecting light. They're ubiquitous in that sense. Look up that word if you don't know what it means. There's a padded divider set that comes with the case. I think this isn't it. This is from a different case, but I threw it in because it helped provide another layer of padding between all that stuff and all of these stands. So I've got a couple more light stands in here and a third light stand and then the really big light stand. Uh, this is the padded divider that actually came with the bag. It's pretty decent. It's got these uh, side dividers that are meant to go this way, but I put them all on the back side here to kind of keep this bag from not losing its shape. If you prop all this stuff up, it'll stay open pretty well. Uh, I also have these side pockets on here. We've got clamps of all shapes, sizes, and varieties. They're color-coded based on awesomeness. Also in this one, oh look, these are the less awesome clamps because they're orange, so got those in here, as well as some uh, Velcro ties, very important. And uh, this bag, in addition to being incredibly heavy, thankfully, it does come with a uh, pull-out tote carrying handle strap thingy, which retracts conveniently into this zip-up pouch. On the back, uh, it does have three rolling wheels, perfect for toting through wherever it is that you're going. They look to be like rollerblade wheels. They're not the best, but they're not the worst. Um, on the bottom too, it's got these uh, three rails, um, which are pretty good for supporting the base. That's the whole bag. It's the only bag I could find that was big enough to hold uh, my mic stand, which is also in there, which you don't see because I'm using it right now. And uh, all of these other stands whose combined lengths equaled what I could not find for very cheap elsewhere. So I'm gonna put a link to this in the video description. You can check it out. It's holding up pretty well so far, but I don't imagine this bag is gonna make it past a few years. When you have all this stuff in it, it weighs a ton. It absolutely kills your back to haul it. So the advantages is that it fits everything and it's got pockets. You can load it to the gills and it'll still zip. Disadvantages, uh, you will literally pop a vertebrae out of your spine when you pick it up. So make sure you have your doctor's phone number handy for after your next video shoot. But overall, I definitely recommend this bag that I mentioned you can put bodies in it. All right, see you all. Bye.